Hi, I'm Lynette. Today, I would like to discuss the link between anxiety and motivation. You might be thinking that anxiety can zap your motivation. However, this does not have to be the case because instead, anxiety can be used as a source of motivation. To explain this idea further, I'd like to mention a very helpful article written by Melinda Best entitled, Anxiety Can Bring Out the Best. Melinda points out that you can become effective in life by channeling your anxiety into useful action. We at PanicAttackRecovery.com would like to share ways that you can channel your suffering from anxiety into useful steps for dealing with issues. Here are seven steps to get you started with today. Step one, make the decision now to commit to changing your negative thoughts or behaviors. Through our videos, website, and other media, we provide a number of techniques that you can use to work on your thoughts and behaviors. Commit to learning and using some of these strategies on a regular basis. Step 2. Schedule time to practice techniques to combat your anxiety. Treat this time very seriously and ensure you carry out these techniques on a regular basis. This will help to avoid the tendency to slip back into your previous thought patterns, which gave rise to your anxiety. Step 3. Consider keeping a log of your feelings and thoughts each day. This doesn't have to be complicated, but being able to look back on your feelings and thoughts can be very helpful in seeing common themes. This can then allow you to more easily address your thoughts and feelings that you may have dealt with previously. In order to fully appreciate this activity, you need to give it a try. Step 4. Recognize and remind yourself that change takes time. By proceeding slowly but steadily, you can find little successes. Small, consistent changes over time will allow you to ease into a newer and healthier way of thinking. Step 5. Celebrate small successes and don't be too hard on yourself if you stray. Step 6. Write down the following words and place them somewhere that allows you to see them on a daily basis. Embrace your fear. Dr. Stephen Josephson, psychologist, indicates that embracing your fear is also a major component of cognitive behavioral therapy, which is widely seen as the most effective treatment for anxiety disorders. Identifying and challenging self-defeating thoughts and gradually facing the source of fears can provide more lasting relief than anxiety medications, psychologists say. Step 7. In order to forge ahead, keep in mind that at times you will likely need to push yourself a little in order to carry out the required techniques for recovery. However, we think that you will find the extra effort is worth it. Please don't forget to subscribe to Panic Attack Recovery on YouTube and follow us on Twitter. We share useful information through our various media. If you would like references to the information presented in this video and or additional tips and information concerning anxiety, panic attack, and agoraphobia recovery, please visit our website and subscribe to our free newsletter.